Good day everybody, welcome back to It's a Small Vlog and today I am at Disney's Animal Kingdom and I don't normally film at this park very often but today is a very special day, today is April 22nd, 2023 and today is Animal Kingdom's 25th anniversary, it opened 25 years ago today um, on Earth Day 1998 and we're just gonna kind of spend the morning, early afternoon here in the park, see what's going on. Similar to Epcot's 40th anniversary celebration. You know, we're just gonna be seeing everything that's happening today. I don't really, again, I don't really vlog at this park that often, but I'm pretty excited to. So, happy anniversary, Animal Kingdom. 25 years ago today, Disney's Animal Kingdom opened to the world. It's crazy that this park is 25 years old, and this is Disney's most recent park crazy the current time is just after 7 30 this park opens at eight o'clock so this park opens the earliest crowd wise not looking too bad i have never uh rope dropped this park before i've never been this early uh to this park so this is definitely a first for me again i do not come to this park that often simply because there's just normally not that much to film here but today is a very very special day so upon walking into the park, we have these 25 year banners adorning the entrance, which look really nice. And then this is new. I think they just added this a couple days ago. They have a new Disney 100 sign uh, right here in front of the ticket booth, which looks really great. Very nice to see some Disney 100 stuff popping up at this park. All right, we have made it into the park. Look at all of this. This is so awesome. Hi there. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Oh, awesome. Commemorative guide map. Oh, they're very similar to Epcot's 40th anniversary. Oh, how sick is that? Awesome. Anyway, we're going to explore the oasis a little bit. Um, I don't know how far they let you go when rope dropping this park. Oh, well, I see a bunch of crowds up ahead. So I guess we're about to find out. So right now they are holding us right over here in the oasis and the oasis is fairly deep so i definitely think there's quite a few people ahead so i don't think that they've let anybody onto discovery island yet so this is interesting again i've never rope dropped this park before i've never been this early to this park so anyway while we're waiting maybe we'll look out for some animals got some disney ducks while we're waiting Good morning. <laughs> All right, park just opened. There's an 8.30 show that we're gonna go see in front of the Tree of Life. Ooh. Happy birthday. Just 10 minutes. We are invited to the Tree of Life. Please stand we celebrate the 20th anniversary of Disney Yay! Alright, well you heard the lady. Ten minutes until this show starts. Awesome. Disney said, what I have learned from the animal world is 
So here in the uh, gift shop, they have this little section roped off for the 25th anniversary merchandise. And there's actually a line going all the way out the door. I don't know how long that this line goes. Yeah, not a ton of 25th anniversary merch. Maybe I'll wait in it a little bit later. But uh, yeah, there's a little bit of a line. Hopefully it won't be as bad as Epcot's 40th. All right, found the end of the line. It just ends right here, right by the Simba statue on the way over to Pandora. Not too bad of a line, actually. Not nearly as crazy as Epcot's 40th. All right, we're walking over to Pandora. Look who decided to join me today. We got Jessica, Duffy, and Hunter. Animal Kingdom's 25th. I cannot believe that this park is 25 years old. Yeah, so. What are we doing? We're going we're over to- We're gonna check Flight of Passage. Yeah, we're gonna check, uh, check out Flight of Passage. It was like 155 minutes on the app. I don't think that it's gonna be that long, so we're gonna eyeball it. And then if it does look that long, then maybe we'll do like the safari or the boat ride or something like that. So that is our game plan right now. This is gorgeous, come on. Pandora, it's almost six years old, still beautiful. Still so beautiful. Crowd-wise, not bad at all. Look at this. Pandora can't explain how beautiful this is. Look at this. It's so gorgeous. So beautiful. So beautiful. We decided to wait in line for Flight of Passage. Look at this view. Come on. The level of theming in Pandora is just unmatched. Gorgeous. Hi, and welcome to the Avatar program. Soon, you're going to have a chance to undertake an amazing Navi Rite of Passage, riding on the back of a Banshee by being genetically matched and linked to an Avatar. Using Avatars to fly this way was all figured out by my boss, Dr. Jackie Ogden. She leads her science team, which is part of the Pandora Conservation Initiative, and we're here in the Valley of Moara studying Banshees and their environment. Update, um, we just got off a of flight of passage, which was... How long did it, it was? It, it was, said it was. It said 155. It was like two hours by the time we got off the ride entirely. Yeah, so like it wasn't horrible. I think we waited like 95 or like 100 minutes or something. I mean, we didn't really have anything else to do. So it all worked out. And then we had a very early lunch. It's 11:10 right now. A very early lunch at Situli Canteen, my personal favorite quick service restaurant. And now we're heading over to Kilimanjaro Safaris, which is kind of a long wait, but. I mean, it's, it's, it's a safari ride, you know, like you're kind of obligated to do that today. So we're going to go over there. Jess is going to give us a bunch of animal facts. She's extremely smart when it comes to that kind of stuff. And that is where I lack in my Disney knowledge. So yeah, she didn't have a microphone and everything. So that is what we are up to right now. All right, wait time says 70 minutes. Doesn't look too bad though. We're moving along quite nicely. I don't really see anybody up there. So hopefully this will be a little bit shorter. I don't know. I cannot remember his name. Now if that is our little you... one and her mom, actually, Mama has been with us for all 25 years that this park has been open. Wow. Oh, that. That's cool. I can't... I'm going to see some African painted dogs. All right. Also known the as one wild dogs. Also to us here. They uh -huh. are the most white on successful back. Pretty sure that hunters on the savanna. Uh -huh. They have a success oh, rate of them. 80 to 90 right percent. There. Yeah. They're pack I can't, hunters, I can't make out like the their ancestor, the, others, the wolf. But I know that and the alpha is named Oswald. Too, so instead uh -huh. of attacking the, uh, their prey, the they'll just chase of the it until it drops from exhaustion. I'm not sure which one's which from this distance. Giraffes will eat for about 20 hours a day, and they only sleep for 30 minutes. Not all at once either, they the, just take one of the uh, younger ones the day is about back there. minutes at a time. On the, on and they sleep teenage staring giraffe. up. Looks like a teenage giraffe to me. Mm -hmm. I don't remember what any of their names are though. And they do use their it's very long and yeah. flexible tongues to grab their food. Giraffe tongues can get to be about and I think, 18 I think over inches in the back, long. I'm pretty sure that's an eland. 
Uh-huh. And they'll use it to reach And I actually have a pretty funny story about one of the elims. Mm -hmm. It is very I heard just from one of the uh, and looking branches, lodge cast the branches into their mouths. But one and of the elims, it'd be funny if it's that one. Their cousins, the he was transferred from the lodge to the safari because he was like getting in trouble at the lodge. Like, he kept starting fights with the other animals at the lodge. And... On the safari, he Which somehow managed to get here. to the rainforest, like with the bongo and stuff. Wild, and they actually had to animals, shut down the entire ride to try to get him back to where he was supposed to be. He is case, a troublemaker. We very scientific <laughs> methods of getting Wait, them out of the name? road. I don't remember what his name like, was, uh -huh. but it's one, one of the Elans. He was tr causing trouble with his brothers, and they had to transfer him here. They stand in their own purpose. They're much good. Their stripes are. Does the very second one here, does he look smaller to you than the other two? And the second one? Yeah. Up on their yes. Their heads. I think that might be Trooper then. Trooper. He, he was born at the Animal Kingdom Lodge to his mom, Heidi. Wow. Oh, there's yeah. an elephant like, all the way over there. All over the place around here. Oh, African wow. elephants, of course, how do we know? Easy, we're in Africa. But also by the shape of their ears, an African elephant's ears looks a lot like the continent they're from. They're very wide and rounded at the top. Around a flamboyant. Uh, look look carefully at the flamingos. shape of the island. Uh -huh. The island itself is a hidden These are the largest and lightest species. Oh, yeah, I see that. Species, you have the base but no and flamingo oh, yeah, starts the two out pink. Ears. It's kind of hard to see. They all come out of their shells looking a bit like yep. little gray fluff You're balls. Welcome. They'll start to develop their pink colored hitting. about three months after they're born. And no lions today. Them as lookout spots. But if you look at this rock here, it's hard to make out, but it's supposed to be Donald's head. Oh, oh yeah, I heard about that. that. Perfect Fair. Shape. I always I thought like, it was a bit of a stretch. Yeah, yeah, it is, but it was in the official Hidden Mickey box back in the day, so like... All right, I'll we'll we count it. And we do have a whole crash of... All right, so Animal Kingdom's got two tigers. At the moment, neither of them are uh, really in a good spot to see them, but we do have a girl, Anala. She was born here back in... Uh, October 2017, I want to say. She and her brother, Jetta. Jetta is no longer here. He was transferred to a different zoo, so he could help create more tigers at a different zoo. Mm -hmm. Anala is still here, and we actually recently, just last November, or in November 22, brought in a tiger named Conrad from a different zoo. And the hope is that the two of them will, at some point, have some cubs. I know um, Anala's dad, a couple years ago actually died of cancer. I'm not entirely sure what happened with the mom, but I don't believe she's around anymore. So it's just an all on con right now. Hey, look who it is past Dino Land. It's Kevin. He's out and about. Hey. Oh my God. Best walk around character for sure. Oh, that is awesome. Oh my God. Anyways, that is going to wrap up the video. Current time is 1.15 exactly, so we're here in the morning and the early afternoon. We did a decent amount. I mean, we did the two e-tickets. We did the safari and flight of passage. It was just very crowded this morning. I don't really feel the need to stay here the rest of the day, but, you know, it was good to be here on Animal Kingdom's 25th, you know? And thank you, Jessica, for giving us all of those awesome animal facts. You are, the knowledge amazes me. Any last words? Um, no, not really. Any, anything, Hunter? Uh, no, it was good to be here. Yeah, it was. But anyway, um, if you enjoyed this video, like, subscribe, leave, leave those notifications on so you don't miss it anytime I upload a new video. Comment down below um, if you plan on visiting Animal Kingdom sometime this month, because I think the festivities, I mean, not necessarily a specific day, but like food-wise, and I think some merch are lasting like Yeah, those are lasting for a month. Yeah. So something like that. So, you know, if you're around, be sure to stop here at Animal Kingdom. It was very similar to Epcot's 40th. It was a pretty low key day. So, you know, it wasn't anything crazy, but it was great to be here on its special day. This has been It's a Small Vlog at Animal Kingdom for its 25th anniversary. My name is Bobby and follow the LA. Have a wild day, everybody. Bye.